My love of music started at a very early age. My mom would drop me off at the local mom and pop record store and pick me up an hour later and I'd probably had two or three records and I just remember that experience so fondly. I couldn't wait to get home and enjoy that ritual of sitting down, peeling off the shrink wrap, that smell of the fresh record, putting it on, opening up the gatefold, and really having a multimedia experience. While I'm listening to that record, I'm enjoying the artwork. Maybe the record has photos of the band making the record and their liner notes talking about how the record was made and what's unique about it. It's a much more immersive experience than just listening to something on your computer, on your streaming app. The fastest growing demographic of vinyl consumers are 18 to 24 year olds. And these are people that are of an age that have grown up entirely within the digital era. So we're really excited about all of the synergies and, and the connections between what we're doing downstairs with our vinyl manufacturing as North Carolina's first vinyl pressing facility, but also in the creation uh, and the production of new music as well. Asheville has long been recognized as one of these vortexes, if you will. Like there's something ancient about this place, this location on earth and its beauty in the mountains and it's attracted creatives for generations. So WWNC was one of the most popular radio stations in the country. And it was from this very room that new bluegrass sound was first introduced to an American listening audience. So we consider it a great privilege and responsibility to be able to bring this studio space back to life. As North Carolina's first record press, we felt like it was really special to have a North Carolina-based band uh, be the first record that comes off the press. So Mandolin Orange is putting out a double LP and we're really honored to be a part of that if we can play a role in helping people to slow down and be a part of their self-care regimen by celebrating the arts through these immersive multimedia listening experiences, we feel like we're doing our job as citizens and helping to celebrate that.